Hello everybody and welcome to um, an, in an interesting vlog, hopefully. We're not at home. By the time you see this, Christmas would have already been gone. It might even be the new year. If so, happy 2022. Hope you have a great year. Unfortunately, one of us has COVID. Are we watching Doc? I'm watching Charlie D'Amelio. Oh, that's, that's actually Dixie. I hate to burst your bowl, but that's actually Dixie D'Amelio. No, sorry. Dixie. Not Charlie, all right? Well, I was That's her sister. <laughs> You're watching this. Uh, we've managed to. I've managed to um, get a cable, an HDMI cable, and the adapter that goes into my laptop. So now we can play Netflix, uh, Disney+, Plus, Amazon Prime, all on there. As the hotel is, you know, they still work over the Christmas period. Um, they're making us delicious food and leaving outside our door and breakfasts and things like that. I've decided I'm going to leave my little um, little drawing each time. Say thank you. Christmas in a hotel room in a foreign country. Right on. We we can't get upset about it. We had we had this lovely Christmas day planned to go around Zoe and Alfie's um, Ottilie's first Christmas as well. Um, and if you know my sister, she goes big on these kind of events. She she's a Christmas. Uh, Christmas file, Christmas file. She loves Christmas. So she properly decked the halls this year and it looks incredible, but we can't be there. So, um, and all our presents are up back in the UK as well. So sorry, Diane, you have to wait a bit longer for your, for your Christmas present. It's a bit of a shitter, but at the end of the day, um, I had so many messages and DMs from people um, who were also going for the exact same thing. So many people seem to be getting COVID at Christmas. It seems to be the thing. I think apparently in the UK, every single person in the UK knows someone around the Christmas time who's got COVID. Diane had seven showers yesterday. Um, I think partly down to COVID and making me just trying to warm yourself up, warm your body up, but also partly down to the fact that the shower in our house isn't great and the water doesn't get hot enough and Diane likes a really hot shower. So I think that's partly the reason why you had so many showers. But yeah, we, we're we still feeling very fortunate because we are staying in a really... <coughs> um, it is nice that we have got each other. Uh, and we get on pretty well, don't we? We do. So we should be fine. So I think we're gonna cruise through this. Um, and even better news, we might even have a snowy Christmas because I'm looking outside now and it's currently snowing. I've got a big old Bobby Brewer coming here. You're probably quarantined more than anyone else this year almost. I feel like I am. Jeez, queen of quarantine right there. Should I give you a little tour of the room? I've got to try and work out these light switches because I'm not on. Oh, there we go. Nat now gets rid of the uh, strobing. So here we go. This is where I hang my winter coat which was actually gifted to me, by the way, by uh, Fred. Fred Syriac um, gifted me this coat from Moss Bros. So thank you for the gifted coat, Fred. It's served me well. And through here, we've got a little secret hatch. Um, we've got the main sort of living space, a desk to draw at, uh, our health and wellness station over there, which was initially the mini bar, but now it's full of like vitamins and things to try and keep our health the best it can be. Uh, we've got a reading chair down here where I can read my book. At the moment I'm currently reading Ready Player Two by Ernest Cline, which is uh, a good, uh, so far so good. Along here um, we've got the bathroom. Two sinks, which is good because Diane can have her own sort of covid sink and I can have my nice clean one. A Japanese, we've got a Japanese toilet. I think it's Japanese. It's like, it's got a, a thing that cleans your pupper. Look, the proper jet the arse situation going on. Little Miss, little Miss Covid. Hello. There she is. Covid. How are you feeling? <coughs> oh. Covered twice. You did cover twice, yeah. You want to sanitize his hands now or? <laughs> yeah. I've also ordered ourselves a little Christmas tree. Out here, we've got, it is snowing, is it? kind of. Out here, we've got our outside area, which we can let fresh air in. It's minus two, I think, right now. Um, but here, you can see snow. It is snowing. We've got like an outside space. So we like, compared to your quarantine dot in Australia, I don't know how you did that for two weeks. And this is why we can't complain because 
lovely room, lots of space. We have Vort, so we can order stuff in. Um, even like games, we can order anything off there to be delivered. Like a lovely bathroom, um, and we've got each other, which is the most important thing. Merry Christmas, Dottie. Merry Christmas, Joey. Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs> Not the place that we thought we'd be for Christmas, but... But, hey. Hey, do you know what? This is probably... If I had to make Christmas breakfast, I would not make it as good as this. We've got no. coffee, we've got fresh orange oh, juice, we've got fruit, coffee. fresh fruit, we've got, res uh, what are they called? Preserves, uh, bread, little Christmas brownie things. We've got these, whatever these are. And we've even got Christmas chocolate lollipops. And I still have and, my taste. And you still got your taste and your smell, which is the most important thing. Oh, Christmas um, We've got our little tree going. We've still got our little gifts to open. It's not quite the Christmas morning we expected, but hey, do you know what? It's um, it's it the best it can be. It's one we'll always remember, it isn't it? <laughs> uh, we still got bloody Teletubbies on. We finish. still got te yeah, finished Teletubbies on. That needs to change, doesn't it? Yeah, we need to turn this off. This is not festive at all. Um, the TV channels. We, we, where's the? I can't find the remote. We're stuck. We're stuck it's listening to Teletubbies. Um, I went for scrambled egg on toast. I think. It's lovely. I think what I'll do. Yeah. Is, why don't we... Take it in turns to eat the little table. No, so oh. what we'll do is you can... I'll eat, like... We could eat out. We could, oh, we could eat outside. We could wrap up warm and eat outside at the snowy table. Hey, do you know what? On the plus side, at least technically, we've got a snowy Christmas. This is true. There is bits of snow there. It's a snowy Christmas. Oh, and they've got a flag flying. Is that a Finland flag? That looks like a, I think that's a Swiss flag, isn't it? Oh, no way. Yeah. Oh. God, they want us to start early. Jeez. <laughs> Dear Joe and Diane, Merry Christmas, all our love. Oh, oh. it's your mum. Oh. That's so nice. Oh. Hmm. Um. It's not quite uh, my Christmas Sunday spash, but it's all I've got. I'm running out of clothes. If it don't stink, then continue wearing it. That's always been my motto. So we're gonna go with kind of cozy Christmas. There's one jumper actually I didn't wear um, that I actually got given for Christmas by Diane. So I'm gonna go put that on, I think. Diane got me this from Urban Outfitters, Animaniacs. I used to love this show as a kid. Um, and it's that kind of, that fit, that is just like a nice fit. I'm gonna sort my barnet out and then... You say it's that fit that's just like a nice fit. Yeah, it's, you know what I mean, it's that fit, it's a nice fit. I'm gonna get some socks on and then, I think I'm gonna pop open that champagne. Um, I'm gonna open the champagne and make a, there's enough there for me to do one Bucks Fizz. Although I've never really been a massive fan of Bucks Fizz. I feel like it's kind of like, why is that a Christmas tradition? Is it a tradition in Australia? Mm. What do you like? What's like the drink to drink in Australia? Uh, beers. A bit cold beer. A nice cold beer. Yeah, as I say, freezing cold beer. Out in uh, Finland, they do this stuff you would have seen in the previous vlogs called glurgi. Um, Ooh, which, we have. which we do actually have. Diana ordered some glurgi in. Diana ordered some glurgi, then got the lurgi. But she's feeling better. Why? I have to put a little bit of eyeliner and mascara on. She's got eyeliner and mascara on. That can mean one thing and one thing only. Christmas is well and truly underway. I'm going to spray... I'm going to do a little get ready with me. Um, this is all I use on Christmas. A bit of this. Done. Start my Christmas day. Um, I am in need of a haircut, I realise, but I do want to, I am sort of less letting it grow for a bit. What do you reckon? You look so cute. Do you think? You're gorgeous. Thank you. This is as good as I'm getting today, my Christmas. Hey, you look good. You d at least you don't have to do this half down, do you? Is that on backwards? No. No, it's just tied there. That's how it goes. Oh, you got a belly button on show. You never get your belly button out. Yeah, I got my belly button out for Christmas Day. Wow. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Diane's got a belly button up for Christmas Day. It means business. What are we toasting to? Health and happiness. Health and happiness and for a COVID-free 2023.
even though it's going to be 2022, but that's rhyme, so I had to say it. To, to Diane, no longer having COVID. Hey, do you want, do you want some? Okay, sure? Yeah. Boil the kettle and put a bit of glurgy and a bit of... Okay, you can show them how they make glurgy. I'm going to test this champagne out. Well, I don't know if this is how you make it or not, but... Oh, that's good. What is in this? Because it's all going to be finished. So... There, I'm sure there's an app where you can hold your app against the writing and it translates it all. We'll look back and be like, ah, oh, that reminds me of the time <laughs> okay. Diane got COVID and we were stuck in a hotel room for Christmas. Oh! <laughs> One's for you. Oh, One's for me. Love them. Little Christmas... Little Christmas elves. Oh, they're so cute. You love these, didn't you? Yeah. You would have seen that one. Yeah. Like a bit of me. I thought that's one for Diane, one for me. That is so cute. They're like little, tiny little uh, Finnish elves I with love massive that. long hats. That's so cool. But I just thought every year we can put them up yeah. as decorations and just remind us of. Remind us of that year this that year. we were stuck in Helsinki. <laughs> Merry Christmas, darling. Thank you. You're, You're welcome. So kind. Sorry, it's not anything. F all the fun stuff I got you is back at Don't be back so at silly. home. This is also probably the first Christmas where we can get our gloves on, go outside onto our little balcony, and make an actual snowman. Oh, you've already written Merry Xmas into it. But the plan now is to sort of ball that up into what you can. Oh, it's cold, isn't it? Oh, it's colder than I thought. You're smart, you've got a coat on. Yeah, get all this together. Have we got enough to make a tiny little snowman? Compact that into one ball. Not a one ball, but like a one ball. It's kind of more like, apparently what? though, in a couple of days it's going to snow. Really? Yeah. Well, I was going to say, I hope you won't be here, but we probably will be, won't we? Have we got enough to make a snowman? <laughs> we've got the twigs to make the uh, arms, at least. There's loads of snow up there, it's just we can't reach it. I feel like it's sort of flying down a bit, but that's yeah. just from... But there's surely there's snow bits. Snow Look, there's, there is little bits of snow in the air. Tiniest bits of snow. We need to be more powder-like, don't we? Because it's not compacting together. But I'm starting to get cold. That looks good. There we go. Oh, that's nice. What is it? It's a... It looks like the Titanic. It does, doesn't it? Like a cruise ship. It looks like one of those like quirky desserts you get in a fancy no, restaurant. Buddy hat. It's like the generation game. Okay. You know what you can do with this? <laughs> what? You no. can stick it out your arse. No! <laughs> Sven! I'll give you some snow, look. Oh, oh that's, that's actually... not good. <laughs> you regret doing that. Yeah. Right, see you, Doc. No, don't. Get rid of your COVID out here. Don't you dare. Can't believe you got COVID. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you've got COVID. No, why do I have COVID? It's so annoying. <laughs> that time. Hey, now it feels like Christmas. Come on. Dot's feeling Christmassy. There we go. You are Neil. You are Karen Billy. There she is. Hey. Well, very festive. You are. You couldn't do that right now, could you? Mm, <laughs> Maybe not. Not right now, probably. Expectations. Reality. <laughs> Yes! Check you out! Yeah, well done, Dot. Thank you. You're so good. You did such a good job. Well done, Fred. What, oh, what, oh, what, oh, what, oh, what is our Christmas film going to be, Dot? Well, I don't think we're going to do a Christmas one, but I think... We, I think we've done too many Christmas ones, haven't we? We've got the door open as well and it's getting cold in here, mind. The one good Lord, I'm Lord. thinking of, Joe, is no one gets out alive. What's that? I don't know, but I'm looking at it and I see blood footprints. Yeah, that doesn't sound very Christmassy to me, Mark. So, we ended up watching this film called Cam, which is about like a webcam girl who um, has her identity stolen. Th was actually pretty into it the whole way through. Um, you were loving it. I was loving it, no. It was actually pretty good until the end. The end was just such a letdown, I thought. So shy. It just didn't. The there was, she just 
spoiled no. your nose as well. Never found it. Well, spoiler alert. Yeah, and... you were really suspecting everyone. I was like, it's her, it's her, it's you him. You kept saying there's going to be a real twist in this. Yeah, there's going to be a real twist. There wasn't. The only twist we saw in that film was the cam girls twisting their nipples <laughs> to try and get tips. Yeah, not, not, not the best. It has a really good rating on Rotten Tomatoes, though. Anyway, it's ruined my Christmas. I'm going to end the vlog there. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for, for Christmas. Um, if you don't subscribe, you're going to have a, a, a worse Christmas next year. Um, rock and roll. <laughs> good, good tidings.